On December 14th, Spider-Man Into the Spider-Verse was released in theaters. The movie follows a young Brooklyn teenager named Miles Morales who develops spider-like powers. Miles and five other spider people from other dimensions join forces to defeat the villain Kingpin. We interviewed some students who watched the movie. My favorite part of Into the Spider-Verse was probably the last fight with Kingpin and it was just so cool with all the colors and how it was like all hippy dippy and everything but then like it was also grounded with technology and it was just super futuristic and everything. Yeah I thought it was a great movie. It was really fun. Who favorite part? Probably the ending fight with all the Spider-Man and just how they interacted with each other. Throughout the movie Miles teamed up with five other spider people from different dimensions. These include Peter B. Parker, Spider-Gwen, Spider-Man The Wire, Penny Parker, and finally Peter Porker. I really liked uh, Spider-Man Noir because he just didn't follow the tone of the movie and it was just really interesting to see him interact with all the other characters. Probably the Nick Cage Spider-Man because he was like uh, all black and white and then whenever he was in a room like wind would be there and it'd be like blowing his cape back and everything. On January 6th, the movie won a Golden Globe for Best Animated Feature Film and is nominated for an Oscar in the same category. Probably. I know it's gotten like a lot of praise for being really well done and it was a crazy new style that looked really cool. Yeah, I, I really think that it had the best animation that I've honestly ever seen in a movie and you know the integration of comic book panels and stuff like that was just fantastic. Worldwide, the movie has made over $347,730,624 as of February 4th. With the extreme success of this movie, it, it could possibly get a sequel. Look, I'm a comic book, a serial, I did a Christmas album, and a so-so popsicle.